Adrish Krishna. I am from 8th grade. I study in each international private school to raise Abu Dhabi UA. I am participating in Cyber Square's Digital Fest competition. And my project is a tic-tac-toe game using Python libraries. So let's see the project. My project is a tic-tac-toe game. This game can be played in both single player and multiplayer. If you don't have a friend to play with, you can play it with your computer in single player. And if you have a friend, you can play it in multiplayer mode. So first let's try the single player. So let's try. Mm. Oh. oh, the computer won. So let's try the multiplayer now. Let's see how we go. Yeah. And you know in the multiplayer mode, I don't have a friend with me now. So I'm going to play with my myself. So player 1 and player 2 is me. So let's try for the player 1 to win the match. And there you go. Player 1 won the match. I know it's a cool game, right? So here I have used the some Python libraries. Random. Then I've used Tikinder, then uh, Partial from Functools, and I've used Message Box, which is also from Tikinder, and Dcopy from Copy. Now, this function is used for making the game board. The X is in the like the game board. You must be knowing the buttons and everything where you put the X's and the Y's. Then the get text function is used to show the X's and O's which you click on the board. Then it also shows if the player 1 won the match or the player 2 won the match or it's a tie game in the multiplayer game mode. Then the is free option shows you that if the board is completely free and if the is full option shows that, I mean the function shows that that the board does not have any more spaces to put either X's or O's. Like it's completely filled with X's and O's. Then the game mode PL means it's the game board uh, for the single player option where you play with your computer. Then the PC one shows like the possible moves for the computer to make. Like it shows uh, like things where all you can there's free spaces for the computer to put put its O's and then it uh, like randomly uh, generates a position and like places the O over there. And then the get text PC means to get the X and O's from the PC uh, and and from us also in the single player game mode. Like it shows it up and plus it also shows if the player or computer won or it's a tied game. Now the game mode PC shows the game board when you play the single player game mode. Then the with PC option uh, shows that this thing you can see over here when you choose single player you can see if the player is uh, the player is x or the, and the computer o you can understand that so for that you use this function and for uh, with player so yeah, it's like almost the same but it's in multiplayer if you click multiplayer you can see that player one is highlighted that means it's a player one's time to play the game so if i click it over here then it changes to player two the player 2 gets highlighted because that means that the player 2 stands to play. Now, the function play shows the home page of my tic-tac-toe game. Like, you know, from where I choose single player or multiplayer or to exit the, uh, like the game. So that's all the code and thank you. So let's play the game one more time. Hmm, I'm not going to let the computer win this time. Uh, oh, I won the match. That was nice. 